Hey guys, this is Channel Lafandi, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a bootable USB for Heron's Boot CD with Easy Reboot. So, to do this, you need Easy Reboot. I'll leave a download link for it in the description. You can download it from there. And you need a USB drive, minimum of 2 GB. And finally, you need Heron's Boot CD ISO file, like I have over here. So, let's see how to do this. First, Extract Easy Reboot to a folder in your computer like I do over here. And after extracting, go inside the folder and you will find a file named make etb usb drive. Right click that and click on run as administrator. And you can see a blue console opening up. And it is showing us the number of uh, usb drives plugged in our system. So in this case I have only one so all you need to do now is just select this drive by entering this number so it is one in this case I am going to select this drive by entering the number one and then hit enter are you sure it is ok to format drive one and type y y for yes and hit enter and it is asking us whether to format the drive in FAT32 or in NTFS so I am going to choose FAT32 so I am going to type F and hit enter ok to erase all data on this drive so before clicking ok make sure that you don't have any important data on your USB drive because uh, all your data will be erased after this process I am going to click ok So it is gonna copy over uh, easy reboot files over to the USB and it's gonna wipe over your uh, USB drive so it will take around uh, 5 to 10 minutes to complete so let's wait for this to complete. and now it is asking us to choose a language I am going to go with default one so I am going to type 0 and hit enter choose a keyboard type I am going to go with, go with the default again so I am going to type 0 and hit enter show file name extensions in menus yes Wi Fi yes and hit enter write etb.cfg file yes and hit enter press any key to continue so now let's go to our usb drive and inside it you will find uh, files like these present inside so all you need to do now is just copy over a herons boot cd iso file over to a particular folder so let's do that i'm going to copy over herons boot cd iso copy and go to my usb drive and go inside iso folder and and inside main menu folder and paste it over here and after it has been copied go to organize and go to fold and search options click on view tab and make sure that uh, hide extension for node file types tick is removed over here and then click on apply and ok and now rename this iso file of herons boot cd rename and after iso type win vh make sure that uh, this is an uppercase and hit enter and click on s so go outside and you will find a file named make this drive contiguous right click that click on run as administrator your usb will boot successfully only when this process is complete so don't forget to do it so it will take around uh, 10 to 15 minutes so let's just wait for this to complete
so as the process is now complete let's boot up our usb so as you can see our uh, usb has been booted up successfully now scroll down and uh, select a heron's boot cd and hit enter and then select uh, mini windows xp and again hit enter now you can see it's loading up So as you can see we have uh, successfully booted up our USB so that's it guys if you have uh, any queries leave a comment below and to see more similar videos like this just subscribe us and thanks for watching.